Good morning, Deke here with Montana Custom Kydex with another video on one of our products. Uh, this here is our Bear Spray holster. Um, like everything that we make, just about everything, uh, use .08 Kydex or Bolteron. We've got a few different color options you can choose from. You can find those on the website. Um, but basically, this is going to work for the counter assault and UDAP bear sprays, the like seven to nine, seven point nine and eight ounce um, cans. And the way these work, basically just snap into place. So you can then rotate the handle, of course, if you're carrying left side, right side on a pack to whichever side you want it. You can pull this out lateral, like so. You can pull it out the top. If you need to, you can deploy your bear spray without taking it out of the holster. Watch me touch that off in the garage, that'd be fun. Um, so, you've got several different attachment options depending on how you're going to carry. Um, first off, let's look at the different molly locks. This is our three inch molly lock, spring loaded here. And then you can also order this um, with a five inch molly lock. So, vinyl harnesses. Most of these are coming with molly webbing on the bottom or also on the side here. So you can run this on the side, you can run it on the bottom. If you have two rows of molly webbing, you're just going to slide this three inch molly lock. There you can see it through the two rows there. Lock it into place, and you've got your bear spray holster. Same thing with three rows here. This is the five inch. And so that actually grabs on all three of the webbing straps there. And then same thing, lock it down, and you've got your bear spray on the bottom and like i said these are these have holes on both sides so you can run it with the handle on your left you can run it with the handle on your right just like we showed with the three inch molly lock if you want to run it on the side here same thing you can run it left side right side um, backpacks also a lot of the backpacks are put in molly webbing on the waistband so same thing depending on the size and the spread of the molly. Some packs are using standard, you know, molly specs, some are not. So I just need to know the size of those, but they usually have a little bit of flex to them also. So you'd rather have it a little snug than loose and having play in it. So belt attachments. This uh, setup here has our two inch molly lock, same concept as the three and five inch. And what this is gonna be good for is your, if you've got a backpack with, you know, doesn't have molly webbing on it, but you've got thin webbing on the waistband, you can lock that down and now you've got your bear spray on your waistband. Again, you can do left or right side. You can run it with the opening towards the back, with the opening towards the front, just depending on how you're going to draw it. On this side, we have our adjustable molly lock with a six millimeter gap, you can see here. So this opens up and you've got this little plug here that you can set if you've got an inch and a half belt, inch and three quarter, two inch, or remove it all together and that'll actually fit two and a quarter. So with this application, this is if you want to run your bear spray holster right on a belt that is you know, has some thickness to it. This belt 
is not going to work with the standard 2 inch molly because it's too thick, as you can see there. So, this one here has a gap in it, so we can actually get around the belt just fine. So, it's got a 6 millimeter gap, so it just, you know, maybe measure the thickness of your belt. If you are running a really thin belt that isn't much thicker than what's on the waistband of a lot of the backpacks, you will be able to get away with, with the 2-inch molly lock instead of the one with the, with the gap. Um, so, same thing on there. You can run it left side, right side. You've got different height adjustments. Um, the last option we'll talk about is the Ulta Clip, and these are pretty slick. These are going to mount also, left side or right side, and these are have a spring-loaded clip, you can see here. So these clip down, and these have actually a great amount of force. So if you are not wearing a belt, or you're wearing a fanny pack or something that has a, a real small waistband, you know, something that's an inch or three-quarters of an inch, very thin, or you just want, or you're not wearing a belt at all, and you want to clip this onto your, your shorts or wherever, this puts a lot of tension on there and will also hold your bear spray holster wherever you want it. So those are just a quick video on the different, you know, five different options that we have to carry our bear spray. And actually the sixth option is without you can order this without a belt clip on it and the whole spacing will actually match up to a water bottle cage so of course pull your water bottle cage off of your mountain bike or road bike whatever and you can mount this directly onto the down tube of your bike and i know a lot of people out there biking it's springtime the bears are out and you need to be able to get to your bear spray quickly so um, I put one of these on the down tube of my bike and you can, you can ride away and it's, it's in there solid. You can, you know, put it this way. If you're going to plan to reach down with your right hand and grab it, if you need it, put it this way, if you're going to reach down and grab it with your left hand. But so yeah, mountain bike option, um, on the website, it'll just say, instead of picking a belt attachment, it'll just say no attachment holes drilled for mountain bike application. And then you can just use the screws that are on your water bottle cage on your bike. And you're just going to attach those to the bike frame. And with this, you're probably getting, most of them I think are an Allen head. So an Allen wrench, you know, is going to come in here and be your, your best bet there. If it is a Phillips, um, you might have to ha get a, a short Phillips and a driver, you know, ratchet style to, to get that attached. But I think most of them are... Uh, or an Allen wrench head. So, um, yeah, these are on the website. Feel free to go and check them out and holler if you have any questions. Thank you.